Support for KQED comes from Integrated Resources Group with showrooms in Brisbane, Dublin, and Sacramento. IRG. Surfaces. Selection. Service. MarbleCompany.com. Hey there, how you doing? I'm Ryan Farr from 4505 Meats and 4505 Burgers and Barbecue. Let's make some salsa and guacamole. And my two favorite things to start off any party. So we have our roasted tomato salsa that we're gonna make. By roasting everything, it adds a lot more depth. Anytime you can cook over fire or with high heat, it really enhances the salsa. Really love that charred flavor. So here's our roasted tomato, jalapeno, and roasted onions. When blending the salsa, I don't like to let it blend too long or too high of uh, speed because you really start to add a lot of air in here. And so I want to just kind of go lightly, just enough to break up tomatoes and chop up the onions and jalapeno and really kind of mix all those flavors together. We have cilantro. When it comes to herbs, I really like just kind of torn herbs and we're going to kind of blend them up anyways. So let's just get just the leaves in there. Let's get some lime juice, cumin, a little bit of salt. That's delicious. Really easy salsa. You just gotta have all your ingredients charred before. All right, so now let's make the guacamole. We got our avocados. I'm not so big on really mashing the guacamole. I like to have more kind of cubed and stirred guacamole so you can really taste that rich avocado. So I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of come in and make slots lengthwise and horizontal wise cut right into the side of that avocado, and it's really gonna help me get a really nice, even dice. So we're gonna take our spoon, we're just gonna spoon out our avocado. And get that nice salt. Swamp chilies are one of my favorite chilies. They have a really nice heat, and a nice little sweetness I like to them as well. Depending on how hot you like it, you wanna remove some of the seeds. So I'm gonna keep some of the seeds in there. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a nice little fine dice here. Just go ahead and start with half. And the red onions are really nice and sweet, so we don't want to have too big of a pieces because you don't want to just taste the onions. So we're going to try to get a really nice small dice with this red onion here. Next, we'd have our cilantro. But I just want to get all the stems out. All right, so let's now get our lime juice in here. Stir it. And even it's the friction of stirring it, it starts to kind of mash up a little bit, but you still can get the texture of the creamy uh, avocado. So a little more salt. Lime's good. Scoop and serve. All right. Nothing goes better with, with guacamole and salsa than chicharrones and cracklins and beer. Enjoy. Enjoy.